Um, hello again, we're back um, doing uh, a video. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about, um, my name is Carlos, by the way, Carlos Brand, um, with ACIT Driving School, and I'm here with Mandeep Burmi, he's also from ACIT Driving School. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about uh, driving in the rain, you know, the things that can become a factor, you know, and how, you know, uh, how safe it would be, you know, to drive in weather conditions like this, okay? Now, it's not much different than driving in drive payment. Um, it depends on a few things, uh, speed, following uh, distance from another vehicle. These things could be a factor while you're driving in wet conditions, okay? Speed, because you can, um, you can hydroplane. Um, and following distance, because... The road is uh, a little bit more slippery than uh, than when it's dry. Yes. Also, um, especially if the rain just started, usually the the most slippery time is the first 50 minutes of the rain. Now uh, people think it's when it's been raining for a while, but actually not. It's the first uh, 15, 20 minutes. The reason for that is because, especially if it's been dry for for a few days. Uh, when the rain starts to come down, it mix, mixes up with the um, with the grime on the road, the oil that left, you know, from cars and and you know and tires and things like that. Um, and when they mixes up with the water, it becomes like a, a soapy, slippery type of uh, um, mixture, you know, and it makes the road quite slippery for the first 15, 20 minutes. After it's been raining for a while, it washes off. So. It's not as slippery. It's still not as good as drive condition, uh, dry conditions, but um, it is a little more slippery. Yes. Yes. So we should watch our speed, our speed, and also um, uh, the following distance. So you have to increase your following distance. When of it's course. Raining. Yeah. Yes. Uh, you know, I. You know, we're talking about minimum following distance. You know, and under perfect conditions would be two seconds is that inside the city two seconds or it doesn't really matter it doesn't really matter how fast you're driving it's the same whether you're driving on the highway or in the city um, because someone told me four seconds that's that would be ideal okay minimum is two seconds minimum two seconds. yes but again that's what the law says that's what you know specified by the law but you know, we recommend at least four seconds following yes. that. Especially yep. if the conditions are not ideal, like rainy conditions like they are now. You know, maybe winter driving conditions and things like that. Um, yeah, so it does definitely should be at least four seconds. And uh, what are some of the other things um, that drivers should know when it's raining? So, obviously, um, should know how to use the wipers and sometimes your windows they will start to fog up as well correct yes and that happens because of the humidity builds up inside the vehicle right yes now um you have to be very careful now sometimes people are driving around in the rain and the windows are all fogged up and and you know they're full of fog they can't see and they got their wipers on and they got the air flowing and there's nothing cleaning the windows the reason for that is because there's a setting in your vehicle and your controls that controls whether you get air from the outside of the, you know, uh, of the car, and or you want the same air circulating inside the vehicle. Now, if that setting is on circulating inside, like the same air circulating inside your vehicle, you won't be able to get rid of the fog inside your car. So you have to make sure the settings on your dash, you know, on your controls is set on uh, fresh air coming into the car. If you don't have that, you'll have a hard time getting, you know, keeping your windows clear. Okay, very good. Yeah, so very good, uh, very good information, Carlos. Um, thank you very much. And uh, if you guys are looking for driving lessons in uh, Edmonton, Alberta, uh, you can give us a call or send us a text message. And um, thank you very much. Uh, please uh, subscribe to our channel for more videos. And uh, if you guys have any questions, uh, just let us know and we will do another video to answer your questions. Again, thank you very much and um, call us if you're looking for a driving lessons.